Hey farmers, what's going on? Welcome back to another heated video. In this video, I'm going to be talking a bit about Bingo Derby. As you can see at my home, I've unlocked an achievement for the bingo lines, which I'm going to collect later. So I think I'm just going to come to the derby and see what tasks are there that I can take. Okay, let's just start playing the game. I'm going to harvest my crops, some clay and rice, and ooh, two tapes. Perfect. It's rare that I get like the same tool when I harvest my crops. Anyways, we've done all the crops and I'm going to go with some sugar canes over here and I will go with my carrots. Okay, perfect. There we go with all the crops. Let's do my honeycombs and I'm going to collect some ores that I haven't collected. Wait, that's a lot of ores. Oh, I know that I did like a couple of mining tasks and maybe my barn was full so I just couldn't collect it. So yeah, let's do the dairy over here. Wait. Okay, let's make some, I think I'm just going to make some cream. I'm actually good on the butter right now. Let's run my um, sugar mill. I don't have any sugar cane, so I'm going to put a few of white sugars. Let's make more bread. I can't believe I have zero. That's not great at all. And the other machine that I was going to run was, um, wait, I know that I have to make a lot of sushi. I did so many trucks. I made like... 800,000 XP, which is still not a lot, and I told you guys that it's hard for me to level up because I don't do crazy trucks, so I just do whatever I can, but I knew that I had to make some sushi, so maybe I'm going to put like a couple of uh, sushis, and now my rice is dipped below. Uh, we'll check that later. Now I'm going to come to the derby, and I'm just going to be talking a bit about the bingo derby. What is the bingo derby? In my opinion, bingo derby is the hardest derby in the game. Uh, it's very challenging, and the only way to do this is being coordinated with your neighborhood. Cooperating with others is the key. So if you're in a neighborhood that is in chat, I'm sorry, but you're not going to do the bingo derby there. Communication with your neighborhood members is definitely very important in this derby. For example, if I go over here to my neighborhood notifications, you guys can see that uh, the leader or the co-leaders have put a lot of messages here, like, uh, they've put the messages that what tasks are we going to do, what tasks are we not going to do, what tasks should we prepare. But another main challenge about the bingo derby is that nothing is predictable. You, you don't know what tasks are going to come and what are not going to come. So you just can't really prepare for this. I mean, you can prepare for a couple of tasks, but uh, finalizing everything in the beginning, that's not going to make sense because things can change. For example, we were meant to do the line on the left-hand side, this line, uh, the T, the wool. We were supposed to do this one. And guess what? The cucumber tasks just didn't appear. But luckily, you can see we've done all our three lines. Um, communication is the key, and we played very well. So the bingo board shows the tasks that you have to complete in order to achieve those lines. And once you complete those lines, so you can do three of them, you get extra prizes, just like you catch bunnies in the bingo derby. And I'm also very happy because I finally completed my stacking last achievement, which was the bingo bonanza three get 20 lines in bingo derby. So let's claim my rewards. I got 10 diamonds and 3000 XP. Really awesome. Now there's just one left, which is a glitch because I'd already completed it. And I think in two years ago, there was a glitch in the game where this achievement was recent. Yeah, the generous neighbor. I've already donated 4,000 items. You can see my neighborhood house already has that beautiful gate, you know, the arch gate. So I don't know why that shows. Technically, I've already done 150 achievements, but it still shows 149, so maybe you'll have to donate more. But yeah, that's all about the bingo derby, and now I need to do two more tasks because we do 10, so these are the tasks that I did. I actually did just uh, three bingo tasks because others did before me, so this wasn't a problem, and we're actually winning right now, so... Yes, that's um, how you play the bingo derby. It's definitely not my favorite. I don't think I'll play it anymore just because it's boring and it's kind of challenging and I don't want to put myself into a challenge just with the derby. No, I still prefer the bunny derbies. I mean, I think bunny derby is not that challenging. It's You just have to wait and then you have to complete the tasks. But this one is really boring. Uh, it might not be that challenging when there are less members in the neighborhood, but when there are more members, you have to do more bingo tasks. Like, we had to do just four of each task, like four mining, four carrot pies, four tacos. And if there were more members, then we might have to do, like, eight, seven. That would have been a disaster. 
But yeah, that's all about this video. I'm really happy to complete my achievement and we've also completed the three bingo lines. Let me know you guys bingo's progress. Are you guys playing the bingo derby? Is bingo derby your favorite? And how many lines have you guys completed already? Subscribe to the channel for more Haiti videos coming. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.